Hello guys, Blader Dasher back, and today, in this video, I'm going to be unboxing Rhino Horn, um, 380 Spike. So, um, right before we get started, please hit that like button, and subscribe, click the notification bell, if you want to see my next video come up, and tell me down in the comments down below, what other videos I should do next, what other battles I should do. But other than that, we'll start. So, the reason why you saw this giant sticker was because it came from Hong Kong for, um, Hong Kong and came here. So, that's why. So, even though it came from Hong Kong, it's still the real Takaratomi version. It just came, it just didn't come straight from Japan. So, if it has this blue sticker right here, that means it came from Hong Kong and it won't be able to work with the app until around January January or February. So, um, let's stop with the chit chat and let's start the unboxing. If you see my other unboxing video with Night Lance, that would that was really cool. Um, that it was a really nice looking Beyblade. So let's see how this bay looks. Rhino horn. Let's see, I heard it's a very very small Beyblade. So let's see. If it's true. It's a very interesting design for a defense type. I heard Spike is a bad bit though. Alright. Here's the spike bit. Oh my gosh, that spike is so small. I can hardly tell if there's a spike in the middle. Oh my gosh, this is so tiny. Okay, we'll start off with the layer first. This is Rhino Horn. So, here is Rhino Horn. And let's grab like, uh... Night Lance for my other video, for example. Look at the size difference. That's crazy. This thing's tiny. Oh my gosh, I'm curious how much this is going to weigh. Alright, now we have the 380 Ratchet. I really like how it lo um looks. I really think the purple and kind of the clear blue or whatever. I mean, clear white or whatever. It looks really, really nice. I think that's a good choice. And now we have Spike. Spike, I can't even tell there's a point in the middle. So here's Spike. And here I have the original needle. So yeah, um, this, this bit is probably the worst um, Beyblade X bit out there. Um, because since it has a very small, um, um, point in the middle, it can't really grip onto the stadium as well as the needle. 380's pretty good with defense combos, and this is a good attacker, but it has very low stamina. I heard this Bay stock combo first quite a bit because it has so much recoil. And here's Rhino Horn. So I'm going to do a weight comparison to some other X Bays and I'll tell you the weights of it. I'll do Night Shield. Actually, I'll do Night Lance and Drain Sword. So Night Lance is. 41.7, Drain Sword is 43.2, and now we have Rhino Horn, which is 
41.5. So it's close to the weight of Nightlands, just by a tiny bit. So, but it is a small bay. But yeah, now we are going to put this up against some opponents. I'm going to put it up against Hell Scythe. Night Lance, and I'll put it up against Wizard Arrow. So let's see how Rhino Horn does against this stuff. We'll start off with Hell Scythe. Man. Oh man, it feel, it's very, very passive. Oh, holy! That was the biggest hit I've ever seen in a gauge like in any of my battles with a gauge like that. Holy crud! <laughs> One win, one loss with hell. Now we'll be doing night Man, it might be a good counter attacker or counter punch for this matchup. Okay. But the square shape on it is so, it's so beautiful. It's probably one of my favorite things. Very good color choice for our Okay, now we're on to the final opponent, Wizard Arrow. So far my battles with Planet Lance have not been burst yet, so that's pretty interesting. Alright, well there's one more, so we'll wrap up the video. Wizard Arrow was so close. Wizard Arrow and Rhino Horn were so close getting knocked out. Alright, I think Wizard Arrow has this. No doubt. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's just here. That just shows that Spike is a very bad bit for defense. Okay. That'll wrap up this unboxing. So if you liked this video, Please like and subscribe. Click the notification bell if you want to see my next video come up. And tell me down in the comments down below how much you like Rhino Horn. In my opinion, it's probably one of my favorite looking um, Beyblades. And plus, they didn't do this for Metal Fight. I tried to watch the plastic gen, but it just looked too kiddish. So I didn't watch it. Watch it. But I haven't seen a Rhino Beyblade before, so this is my first um, time I've seen a Rhino Beyblade. But be sure to like and subscribe. But other than that, Blader Dasher, out.